Hey everybody, Dan from On One, back with another sneak peek episode. Let's continue talking about Brilliance AI. If you've watched some of the other videos, you've learned that Brilliance AI can correct the color and tone in your photos automatically, and it can also add regional adjustments automatically, so it can do things like darken a sky or lighten a person. But some of the other things it can do is it can control other things that Photo Raw does, like noise reduction. So in this case, I'm going to show you how it can work to automatically help you reduce noise. This photo was shot at 6400 ISO. And if we zoom in here, I'm going to zoom in a bunch so you guys can see it. You can see it's a pretty noisy photo. You'll also notice that it's got a nasty yellow color cast and it's pretty overexposed. It's starting to blow out the bricks in the building behind. Well, let's watch what happens when I turn Brilliance AI on. Bam, there you go. That's a big difference. Let's take a look. There's before and there's after. You can see how it's reduced that color cast. It's also fixed my exposure problems back here on the church, but even more than that, you'll notice how it's now nice and clean. It's turned No Noise AI on and removed all the noise for me. And it's done that based on ISO. So in the Brilliance AI section, you'll see No Noise is set to on, and it flipped on because I have my ISO threshold set to 1600. You can control that in the preferences. Basically, you say anything above this ISO, turn no noise on for me automatically. Let me show you another photo. Here's another one, also shot at 6400 ISO, but with a different camera. You'll notice that the highlights are overexposed in this one as well. It's got a cool color cast, and if we zoom in and we look, there's quite a bit of noise in there as well. Let's see what Brilliance can do. Bam, there we go. It's found that color cast and removed it. It's fixed the overexposure problem, but it's also brought up the shadows. It's like having a fill light. And if we zoom in and we take a look at the noise, you'll notice it's gone now. It's nice and crisp and clean. Let's take a look at the before and after again. Before and after. What the heck? Let me show you one more. This one's a night scene. They're notorious for being high noise. Even though this is shot at a more modest 1600 ISO, it's shot on an older camera. Let's zoom in and take a look at the noise on this one. You can really see it up in the sky. And if we come down to an area like the rock, you can see that noise pattern as well. Let's turn Brilliance AI on. There you go. You can see it's pulled that noise out. Let me zoom up around the photo so you can take a look at some other spots. It's now nice and clean, but it's also corrected the color and the tone in the photo. Let's look at the before and after. There's before and after. And I can fine tune that in here with my local adjustments. Maybe I want to darken the sky a little bit more. There we go. Just like that. All right, there you go. You've seen how you can use Brilliance AI to automatically detect noise in your photos and reduce it. Just part of the Brilliance AI workflow, making it so much easier for you to get your photos out of the camera, making them look great so you can get onto your stylization, the type of things you do in effects and layers. Coming soon in PhotoRaw 2024. Thanks for watching.